What's up guys, it's Cody. Today I'm going to be building the X portion of the Snappy Rip Prep. This, is, this was a big print that took a lot of time and I'm going to be screwing the pieces together and assembling X axes. I had to slice the parts in half because it wouldn't fit on my printer. So here's the assembly. Alright, so the first step is going to be gluing all the pieces together because I had to slice them, like I said, to get them to print on my printer.
All right, a few more pieces to go. The, all the hot glue is done. We're going to put the gear shaft piece onto the motor. Okay, so it has to go all the way onto it. Parts I've got right now, I'm gonna go get a hammer to use, soft hammer to use on it. Alright, so I got it on here with a soft hammer. The next step is connecting the macro remit switch. This is gonna be a tap fit. Okay, so I think I got it. It's not all the way right to back, but I think it'll work. Next, we're going to connect the pieces together. After we punch out all these holes to get the router to go through.
now that it's all punched out. We'll go ahead and feed the barrel through the hole. Snap the motor in place as it screams. Then right to our feed the wire up through this hole. Now I'm going to snap the motor cover onto it. I think I need to get the hammer again to push the pieces all the way together. Snap the platform pieces together and these pieces together. Then snap the platform pieces on here. I have to screw this piece back together because I snapped it, I think. support or platform support then snap one end inside this on foot It's like that. Right, the last few steps are going to slide it onto this piece. It's really tough to slide on. I think it will. Let's get all started. Oh, it seems really tight. Maybe I'll loosen up. The piece of bricks, I think, would be good for now. And the net rice pieces, the end caps. All right. So this is the final product. Next one be the Y axis.
that gonna be fun once you get through some depth sim after using it. But that's gonna be it for today. Final product, except when the wire through the back of the house, I'll get right through. The top assembly is still a little tight. I think I can loosen that up. So the next one will be the Y axis. It's not a perfect print, but I think it'll work. Thanks for watching this week. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos first, click subscribe. The next video should be out probably in this year.